What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Is your host about? No, it's okay. I'm not white boy. I, I'm just playing all of you just got What is up, guys? So let's let's get straight to the topic of this video. Is that it, it is on prestiging. Now my friends have done some wrong things and some right things. It's mostly wrong things, but they have reset them back straight to level one without even knowing what they did. So and like. Some weird things they haven't, they don't even, they have no idea on what it is about, what what does it do. So I will explain that. I will also explain gun proceedings. So, okay, let's get started on the first topic, which is level proceedings. So, as you know, the levels range from zero or or one to fifty-five in your prestige. Now, when when you get to level fifty-five, you know, you prestige and you have these prestige awards. Those are extra credit class slot. Um, fresh start, and um, forgot the last one, but uh, I'm, sh I'm sure it's really not that important. But anyways, uh, so th those are the three prestige awards. Now, let's talk about the extra kid class slot. Now, when you pick that, you get an additional, additional extra kid class slot. But it, you know, the default classes it ranges from one to ten. But if you let's say you have five custom classes, but if you choose to get a extra credit class slot, then you'll have six and the other four on the bottom will be default. And if you if you keep on prestiging and get like four more credit class slots, those those default classes will be gone. Gone. Alright, so so um that's how the first first little um token or prestige wall works. Now the second one is is a fresh start. Now this is the most confusing one. Now this is what you might think. A fresh start, you might you might think that it will reset your kitty, which it will, and it will it will reset you back to level one. But I think most of you think that it will reset you back to level one on the prestige, but it does not do that. It resets you back to no prestige level one. So that is that is how it works and it's just the way it is. I think it's great if you just if you if you're already a master prestige and you just wanna do do the whole thing all over again, try to get better KD and everything. That's that's only good for them. But if you if you're trying to reset your KD, you gotta go back to level one, no prestige. So watch out for that. Okay, let's get to the prestige tokens that on like forever unlock something like that. So what you want to do is you want to go go um over to any gun, any equipment, any scorching perk, whatever you want. You, now you might want to have uh, a a PS3 controller because I only get PS3, but it's, it's probably similar um on both consoles or remote controls or controllers. Um, so what you want to do is you you want to go over to the item that you have picked and press. R1. It says you want to permanently unlock this item, and you will say yes, and it will permanently unlock it. So if you prestige uh, and you permanently unlock that weapon, you'll have it throughout the throughout prestige and keep on going up up to aggressive uh, present level. So that's how the prestige token works. Now let's get to gun prestiging. Now gun prestiging is is not that very complicated. All you do is just you, you gotta you gotta get your attachments and, and keep on on leveling up into the max level. When it says max, you wanna press triangle on it or at least X X for Xbox. You know, and then and then it will just do it. You know? So you gotta you, you gotta you gotta prestige your weapon and the first time it's prestige it will it will unlock the the clan tag on, on the gun, so you can put your clan tag on. The second time it's prestige, it will have the emblem on. So, yeah, that that'll be all for for this episode. And see you guys later. Sorry, I haven't posted anything lately, but I don't. I've been really busy. All right, see you later. Bye.